Ordering evaluation for Bizworth is simple. All you have to do is go to bizworth.com and click the green get started button. From there, there'll be a few options. If you're looking for a business valuation, be sure to click on that tile. There'll be a few questions for you to answer after that to make sure we're recommending the right report to you, but it's as simple as that. You'll need to be ready to pay when you check out. This will give you access to our secure portal so you can upload your confidential information in a very secure way. So what information do you need? Well, for an informational valuation, such as our essential or standard valuation report, which is great for buying a business, selling a business, or strategic planning. This is when we value 100% of the business. What you're going to need, we would like to collect at least three full years of financial data. And you can choose whether we use the business tax returns or the financial statements. We'd like to have the step period for the year that we're in. So for example, if it is, if we're sitting in June right now, and you have information, complete financial information, through the end of May, you can upload the P&L statement in the balance sheet as of May 31st in whatever year we're in. That way we have a good view of the last three full years as well as the current financial step period. Of course, if you only have one year because you just recently started, that's okay too. Upload what you have and we can certainly work with that. For certified reports, we like to go back five full years. So be ready to upload five full years of financial statements, and that's your profit and loss statement in your balance sheet. And we'd like to also see the current step that we're in. So again, if we're in June and you have financial information through May 31st, be sure to upload the information through that time period. If you are doing an informational evaluation, there'll be one intake form for you to complete. The information that we need there is owner's compensation. So be ready to tell us about the owner's compensation, what the owner has made over the last several years. This data is very important to us because if we value the company with an SDE multiple, that will help us determine whether this has been a reasonable compensation and whether any adjustments are needed. Outside of that, we need this information because we need to decide whether the owner has been paid well above market, well below market, and we may need to make appropriate adjustments as well. There might be some other information such as your NAICS code, which is your industry code. If you don't know it, that's okay. You can write don't know, but if you do know it, be sure to include it. For the certified uh, valuations that we do, there will be three intake forms that you'll need to complete. And it's pretty self-explanatory, but someone that's very knowledgeable of the business should be the one responsible for filling those out. If you fill those out in a very robust way, it will probably take you 30 to 45 minutes at most to complete those. For the standard and essential, that which is an informational, the intake form will probably lay, take you less than uh, 10 minutes to fill out. So it's pretty easy to get started with us. I love the fact that we have a secure portal. You can upload all your confidential information in a very secure way. If you ever have questions during the process, there is a messaging feature within the portal, and you can also call our one 800 number if you have any questions and I hopefully will get to support you very soon. Thanks so much.